Cynthia is a is a great person, uh, someone that loves the Lord, and uh, that's evident in her life, in her actions, in her deeds. She is the true definition of what a mission volunteer is. If you're looking for an Acts 1-8 person, Cynthia is it. Uh, everything about her life is, is about Jesus. She takes the Great Commission very seriously. She truly does go and um, teach all nations, baptizing and making disciples for the Lord. I became involved in mission work as a young girl here at Aliceville First Baptist Church because this church is a very mission-minded church. As a young girl, it was so wonderful when I realized that I'm just a sinner saved by grace and that God loved me enough to send His only Son. And that has given me such a passion to want to tell so many others. And we have an outstanding Pickens Baptist Association headed by Dr. Gary Farley, and we're very active. Acts 1-8 describes her, her missions approach. Uh, she is very involved in our local community. Uh, she uh, participates in a group called the Soul Sisters. Uh, they, they meet on a weekly basis for Bible study at the uh, local community center. She absolutely loves those women and they love her. And many years ago, I became involved. I had a heart for the women in the jail. Here in the community, she's very involved with the prison. She goes um, once a week to um, the prison to lead a Bible study for the women there. It's been my privilege to be with Cynthia on mission projects many times. She's been the uttermost parts of the world to uh, uh, Guatemala and Brazil multiple times. About 10 years ago, or a little bit longer, I became CC, the Gospel Clown. God has opened so many doors, especially as a Gospel Clown. You can go into places that a lot of people can't go into. And, and having someone like that in your congregation allows other people to see that, that missions isn't just something that our appointed missionaries do, that God commands us all to be missionaries. She is everything that I want to be as a mother, as a wife, as a grandmother, as a friend, as a teacher. She truly loves the Lord with all of her heart and with all of her soul. There is nothing like that experience of going and actually encountering people yourselves. God has been so good to me. He's blessed me with a wonderful family, a wonderful husband. And so it's just such a wonderful opportunity to be able to serve Him, to be His hands and His feet, and to just pray to love others with His heart, to be able to share the good news of Jesus Christ.